Hi, my name is Willy and I just had another miserable movie night. I watched this ultimate drill from the year 1974 directed by Robert Butler and starring Britt Eklund and Barry Brown and Eric Braden. You might not heard of these guys before but you sure must have have heard about Britt Eklund because she is the British lady actor star who was famous in her work in Hammer picture films and also of course in The Wicker Man. But this this film does not include any of that clamor of Hammer horror films or Wicker Man films. No, this film is something else. So story goes like this. Britt Eklund plays kind of like this trophy wife who is living in Aspen or in Colorado. Some sort of Colorado skiing resort. Is Aspen in Colorado? I don't know. I'm a Finnish dude. I don't even know where the hell our Finnish skiing resorts are in Lapland. I fucking hate skiing. I don't know anything about that shit. Yeah, but this this girl, she's a trophy wife for this uh, Roland who is a, apparently this corporate tycoon psychopath. Yeah, he's a crazy dude, all right. And these couple of idiots come to the Aspen and instantly they got their eyes on this trophy wife, Michelle. The other one of these guys start hitting on her and later on he goes into their house and the husband is not home. He tells this story that he fall in the river so he had has to take his clothes off to get the dry ones and nothing happens but when the has husband arrives to home of course he thinks that they have been fucking. We have a little problem. What happened? <laughs> Hello. What the hell are you doing here? Uh, listen, man, we're all adults in this house, and what you're thinking is wrong. I fell in the stream. That's right. He was wet and cold outside. It happened this morning, just before you arrived. She's right. I was freezing. I still am. Get out. I'm freezing, man. I'm not leaving until I... You have two minutes to get out. I can't make it two minutes, man. I am wet. My hair's wet. My clothes are wet. My gloves are wet. Everything's wet. One minute, 55 seconds. He gives him two minutes to leave and after this guy Tom leaves, the husband Roland takes the helicopter and starts chasing him. Actually, it's the best scene in this film. And after that... Roland gets his fucking rocks off for killing this dude and after that he goes to bar and kind of picks up this other dude called Joe which happened to be the other one of these dumbasses that I was earlier talking about and the Tom being the other one and this he kind of sets it up so he can he can blame him for uh, being attracted to his wife and trying to hit him on her and so he wants to go hunting again and this time he hunts him with uh, hand glider. Yeah, sure. I don't 
don't know how realistic would that be to hunt hunt someone skiing on a hand glider. Now, now that seems impossible, but he does it, and then Joe just shoots him. The end. The fucking end. I just told you the whole fucking story. This this film has about 15 minutes of story, but it's stretched to 80 fucking minutes. 80 fucking minutes, and you bet your fucking ass, these are the fucking longest 80 fucking minutes you're gonna see. This film indeed includes some some great photography on skiing down the hills. Clearly the film is constructed around this footage. But let me tell you, in the year 1974 that may have been very entertaining, but not in 2019. And all is covered with this kind of mellow ass fucking elevator music. It, it sucked, man. It sucked ass, man. But I like Brit Eklund. She's beautiful. She's cute. She's gorgeous, and she she's a good character in, in this film. But but the other one, um, well, I kind of like the Eric Braden character, Ronald, the psychopathic husband. He seems intimidating, dude. You're a madman. But these two factors do not cover the 80 minutes of this boredom. Now what I have here is a Gerrit film, this kind of TV cover tape, which is kind of rare. But if you if you want to see that, it's really not worth go looking for this. If you're some for some reason collecting, like I am collecting this scan video, Gerrit video, TV cover series then you might get some enjoyment out of it, but the rest of you, stay away from it. Stay the fuck away from it. Man, I get more thrills brushing my teeth and scratching my ass than watching this again. Never ever will I watch it again. No way. And neither should you. So that was my another miserable movie night. Thank you for watching it. If you like this video, please consider supporting the channel by subscribing and hitting that bell button to get notified when there's a new video. If you have any requests about the films you want me to do, please tell me about it in the comment section. For more info, visit videospace.fi, a community for video collectors and movie enthusiasts. Thank you for watching.